What? The zero zero unit? The key to alternative four and humanity's trump card. So she finally finished it, huh? What's today's date? How many days has it been since then? Damn it. Ever since Marmochan died in this world, I haven't been able to keep track. Here I was always the one so concerned about staying on schedule. But at the very least, I can be sure that it's not Christmas yet. Now that the Zero Zero unit is complete, it's pretty safe to assume that there's no chance of Alternative 5 being enacted overnight anymore. I mean, I am happy, but... Damn it. After what happened to Maramochan and Sumika, it's hard to feel genuinely overjoyed about anything. Fair. I feel that. Honestly. I feel that. I can't keep on like this. I wind up breaking the promise I made with the other Yuko-sensei. I just hope I can stay and help see it through to the end. <laughs> Even after I save this world, I still have to find out what it was that made me a causality conductor to begin with. So the faster this war ends, the better. Huh? What do you mean, meet? I mean, don't get me wrong, I want to see the thing, but what about my interview? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Bring it up. So it's portable? Yeah, it's almost like it's got its own set of legs or something. I mean, what? Um, Sensei? Nani? I'm excited to see the Zero Zero unit, don't get me wrong, but what about my interview? Oh, well, okay then. Guess the job must have something to do with the Zero Zero unit. Maybe it's like an assistant operator position or something. Kind of? <laughs> so, hey, uh, just out of curiosity, is the Zero Zero unit pretty small? Like, could you just carry it around with you? I mean, as long as you're not carrying anything else, sure. Yeah, I mean, if you really felt the need to, you could. <laughs> it's definitely possible. You guess? I was kind of hoping for a more concrete... Huh? Already? <laughs> Kasumi. Oh god, I... Kasumi. Nah, see that's the thing, like, I always kind of knew that the Zero Zero unit was going to be, like, sentient in a sense, like it was going to be some form of, like, intelligence, because the whole reason with Yuko's equations was that back in Extra, she was trying, she was thinking about, like, how a computer could think like a human, how she could make it possible that a computer could think like a human. That was the whole point. Of, that was the whole point of her equations, which is what you know. Alternative Yuko was trying so hard to figure out. So I always knew like it was going to be something like sentient, you know. And uh, you know, after what Yuko said before we left the corrupted extra world, and she's like, "Oh, Sumika has to exist there somewhere." And then like the mo, I remember like when I originally recorded this, like it, it clicked the moment they that uh that she referred to the zero zero unit as her like i immediately knew <laughs> i was like oh okay okay like yeah this isn't at all how i predicted sumika might end up in this world i had no idea how she'd end up in this world but uh yeah surprise <laughs> sumika <laughs> Don't remind me of her. 
忘れないよ忘れるわけないよたけるちゃんのことたけるちゃんとの思い出全部絶対になくさないんだから忘れないよ絶対に絶対に忘れないんだからたけるちゃんといて私は私になれるんだからそれが私なんだからそれがたけるちゃんなんだから鏡はどこかにいるはずよだからこそ奇跡が起きた、うん Yeah, and then I have my little th theory on something that'll be explained later, but yeah. Sumika? Is that really her? Sumi. No. No, that can't be. It doesn't make sense. Why is Sumika in this world? I thought. I thought she wasn't supposed to be here. Huh? Alright, easy there, Dimitri. Kill every last what the? One of them. What's she talking about? Every last one of who? No difference in what? Letting her see me? Sensei, what what the hell is going on here? <laughs> Unfortunately, no. <don't they? laughs> That's not what I'm asking. Just just who the hell is this? It's not Sumika. It can't be. You're the one who said that she didn't exist in this world. Because you know, Yuko is totally above lying, right? <laughs> オルタネイティブ4の最大の目的にして成果人類に勝利をもたらす存在。わ。00 why does the zero zero unit look exactly like Sumika? What kind of sick joke is this? Let me guess. You made this using the images of Kas the m using the images Kasumi read from my mind, didn't you? This is just fucked up, is what it is. What? No, don't. If you let it go to your head, you'll just be making the same mistake as last time. If I keep letting my emotions get the best of me, I'll lose sight of what I came back to this world to do. I gotta stay calm. Otherwise, I'll just be Sensei's little pawn all over again. This isn't Sumika. It's the Zero Zero unit. It's both. それこそがベータ殲滅の鍵となる存在。あんたと私が。敵だ。うん。殺す。殺す。殺してやる。皆が。<笑> <Huh? 笑> Why is she freaking out like this? And holy shit, even her voice is identical to Sumika's. Huh? Do what you gotta do, girl. Hey, are you okay? Cool. Hey, snap out of it. Whoa. Don't like that look. This isn't good. All I can think about is how badly I injured her in the other world. Why does humanity's secret weapon look exactly like Sumika? Why did you have to make it in her image? But, hey, what's wrong? Her knees look like they're about to buckle. She's holding her head in her hands. Is she in pain? Sensei, aren't you going to help her? <laughs> yeah! 
Sensei. <laughs> uh, sometimes I, I love alternative Yuko. She just her just absolutely does not give a fuck attitude. It's like yeah, no, she's on the ground writhing in pain. Fuck you want me to do about it, huh? You okay, Sumika? Uh, whoa! Hey! Sensei, why are you just standing there? Did she just pass out? No, that can't be right. The Zero Zero unit's supposed to be some kind of machine, isn't it? Oh, what the hell is going on here? Oh, I'm honored. What a compliment. Huh? No. Yes. When did that happen? Kasumi. Thanks. I mean, I can't exactly refute that, but even so, isn't this a bit much? Huh? What do you mean? あんたは面接にパスしたのよ。よかったわね。この世界に居場所ができたじゃない。はあ。やしろ、もういいわ。連れて行きなさい。はい。ダメ。What <笑> Hang on a second. What's my excuse to stay here? What job did I get hired for? Zero zero unit to no debug to 調整作業。私はもっとエレガントに調律って言ってる. So then you've decided I might still be a useful pawn. Itadesho?利害の一致だって。その意味では前のように対等に。Just like before, you know, when she called you a pawn. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. Wait, Sensei, one last question. Why does the Zero Zero unit... Sensei? Top secret mission? So, you I mean, that is very much a lie, but okay. <laughs> I was not on a dangerous, well, depends on your definition of danger. Brutal? Not really. Definitely not on the front lines. It's been taken care of? What does that mean? But Sensei, do the others even remember me anymore? Huh? Did you say that using the device would make them... うん、そのこと。大丈夫よ。あ。あんたが2人になる問題を解決するために装置を改良したでしょ。その問題はその時クリアしてるわ。I see. You fixed both problems at the same time. That sounds a little too good to be true. Mm-hmm. Come to think of it, why would you leave my room intact anyway? Mm-hmm. It's almost like she completely planned on you returning or something. Did Sensei suspect I might come back? Or rather, did she know I would? Listen, I've been telling y'all since the very beginning, alright? This woman is 500 steps ahead of everyone else, all right? Specifically this Yuko. The other Yuko, she's she's a damn smart woman. For facts. And she's definitely a, a few dozen steps or so ahead of you. Absolutely. But this woman, this woman right here, alternative Yuko, bruh. Alternative Yuko, she's, she's fucking, yeah. She's so far ahead of you, you can't even comprehend how far ahead of you she is. <laughs> I've I've been tell I've been telling y'all this for fucking technically hours now, but 
fucking, I've been saying this. I, I've been saying this, all right? I've been saying this. This woman right here is so big brain. Like, there ain't nothing she ain't account for. All right, she's like, you know what? High probability, she plan totally planned on him running away. She totally planned on him coming back. She totally planned on him suffering through some kind of traumatic event while over in there and that's going to somehow shape him so that when he comes back he's going to be much more matured so that she can actually utilize him to a much better degree all right this woman big thinking 24 7 wait sensei why did you yeah i treat you like one doesn't mean you are one. Damn it. So you're saying you don't actually consider us equals, is that it? I mean, to be fair, I don't think she considers anyone her equal, quite honestly. Even, like, the commander who has, like, say over... Who fucking has more pull than she does. I doubt she even considers him an equal. <laughs> yeah, no shit. I already knew that much. <laughs> そこ Okay, I understand. I hate to admit it, but she's right. I've just got to be patient for now. There's so much I want to ask her about the Zero Zero unit and Sumika, and why she apparently planned around me coming back. But at the same time, I only just got back. There's no telling what might happen next, but we can at least assume there's very little chance of Alternative 5 being enacted on the 24th now. When I think about all the worlds I've screwed up, I can't help but get impatient, but really ought to just take things one step at a time. Yeah, it's almost like your impatience kind of fucked you over originally, huh? You were in such a hurry to keep things moving, get things going, move, 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 gotta jump to the next thing. Then someone throws a fucking wrench in your plans and all oh, little babies gotta go cry in the corner, you know? Like granted, yes, he went through some very traumatic shit. <laughs> I was traumatized by some of the shit he saw, alright? <laughs> but also... <laughs> I can't make the same mistakes I made last time. It feels so weird to be back. I was only gone for a week, but it feels like so much longer than that. When I left, I was so sure that I'd never walk these halls again. But now that I'm back, I feel strangely at ease. Almost like I've come home. God, that doesn't even make any sense. No one's out walking around. Must be lights out already. Though, that's almost as that's almost a good thing, as far as I'm concerned. I know it should be safe to interact with people of this world, but since there's no way to know for certain, I can't help but feel a little anxious. But even so, I'm gonna do this. I have to. I don't care even if they do forget me. I've got a job to do. I'm gonna find what made me a causality conductor and destroy it, even if it's the last thing I do. Nope. Meha? <laughs> Damn it, that's not fair. You can't just sneak up on me like that. Go figure. The first person I run into has to be the hardest one to face. Ugh. Why does it feel like nothing ever goes my way? Because it doesn't. I didn't even get the time to process all this new information. Actually, no. That's not a bad thing right now. It's better that I don't have time to overthink this. I came back here to overcome my naivety. Na naivety. Naivete. Don't know how to pronounce that. <laughs> like, I know what it is, but I don't know how to pronounce it. My weakness and all my other shortcomings. So I have to take responsibility for my problems, and not just run away from them. Yeah. Yeah, earlier today. Now I understand what Maya was trying to do for me. After I trampled all over her feelings, I can finally tell. I need to settle this matter. Make sure I repay her for being so upfront with me. Maya. So hey, about the other night. 
Hey, why are you? Yep. <laughs> Fair. Also fair. Ah. One hell of a thank you. <laughs> yeah, that freaking hurt. Thanks, Maya. I feel I can still count on you to put me in my place with a good hard slap. Me, yeah. Because I'm a dumbass. Sorry. I mean, honestly, there was a point where we thought we'd never return. Thanks for worrying about me. Thanks. Are you really crying over me? Why would you waste your tears on a scumbag like me? Once I fell off my high horse and realized I was a weakling, I tried to take my frustration out on you like a total degenerate. And still you're crying for me? I'm really sorry, Maya. What I did was... Maya. That seems oddly specific, but alright. Yeah, about time, right? Definitely wasn't fun. The front lines, huh? It was just the excuse Yuko Sensei came up with. But it does kind of feel like that's where I was. As a causality conductor, even when I tried to run back to my old peaceful world, death followed in my wake. There's no place for me to run and hide. Not anymore. Ironically, the only place that's safe from the effects of the causality conductor is the world in which the source of it lies. And until I can get rid of that, Anywhere I go will become the front lines, both for me and the people I put in danger. I'm not going to run away anymore, Maya. I'm not going to blame others for my own shortcomings. I won't try to justify the fact that I ran away from my problems. I can finally understand why you acted the way you did during the coup d'etat, and the meaning behind everything Her Highness told me. And what you said to me the day that Sergeant Jinguji died. I finally understand it all. Your words, the way you live your life, they've always haunted me even when I'm out in the front lines. I mean, what do you want me to say? It's the truth. You never change, no matter what world you're in. When I interacted with the other Maya, all the things you said the day I ran away came back to haunt me. Whenever you came into my mind, I realized just how pathetic I was being. In a sense, that was what helped me find my resolve. That and one other thing. While I was there, I ran into some people I thought I'd never see again. So I decided right then and there that I'm going to keep on fighting so that I never have to lose them again. It's just like you said, and like Her Highness helped me realize. There are some things that only I can do. I'm not going to run away from them anymore. So if it's okay with you, I want you to watch over me. And if one day you think I've earned your respect again, I'd like you to forgive me. <laughs> yeah, I guess you did. <laughs> yes, please. I mean, what? <laughs> but let us save that for another day. She's into it. I mean, what? Nah, I think I'm good. Can't afford to die just yet. Dang, seriously? In that case, yeah, thanks for letting me off easy. <laughs> oh, and by the way, I'm pretty sure I'll be back with the rest of the unit tomorrow. Depending on what Yuko-sensei has in mind, of course. We'll yeah, hope so. Right, still gotta make amends with everyone else, too. Understandable. You were, huh? Can't believe you guys were worried about me, even after I left without a single word. Thank you all so much. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Wasn't one of those supposed to cover upsetting everyone else, though? Got it. If that's all it takes to make it up to you guys, I'll gladly take a few punches. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm an officer now. Speaking of which, why are you out so late anyway? Alright, your independent training routine. Gotcha. Still keeping up with it even after enlistment, huh? That's just like her. Okay, nightmare. おやすみ。